Hello from Nebraska. Welcome to Aaron Sports Cards. In this video, I will be diving into 2022 Diamond Kings. This will be the first time I've opened any of this. I've seen it open, but first time for myself. We've got a hanger pack that will have 20 cards. We will have a hanger pack exclusive blue framed parallel on average. And we should have one retail exclusive artist proof blue parallel as well. We got Mickey Mantle as the cover boy. Uh, Panini doesn't give odds, but that's all the stuff you can get. Still a little small in case you wanted to look at that. Then we've got a blaster box that'll have 36 cards. We should find one blaster exclusive red frame parallel. And three retail exclusive artist proof blue parallel. So that's what they look like. The, uh, the framed ones just have a frame around them like that. And then we'll look for the ultra rare downtown inserts that I'm sure we will not find. But they like to tease you with that. So we'll go ahead and start with the hanger pack. Get a look at the cards. Obviously hoping for a wander, but not expecting to pull one. So our first card up, we've got Ken Griffey Jr., who was my favorite player growing up. The kid. We've got Stan Musial. We've got Whit Merrifield. There's Mickey Mantle, We've got Corbin Burns, Miguel Cabrera, Ronald Acuna Jr., Babe Ruth, and then we've got a Vidal Brujan rookie card, like that, for my Rays. He got called up recently, he's playing pretty well. We've got an Edward Cabrera rookie card, We've got a Seth Beer rookie, here is our Framed blue parallel. It's a rookie card of Tony Santian for the Reds. I guess we'll put our framed ones up here. Then we've got uh, Eddie Collins, artist proof. Oops, excuse me. No number on that. Then we've got a an elegance of Roy Campanella. There are quite a few throwback players in this pack. We've got a gallery of stars, Trevor Story. Roy Campanella, Jacob Grom, who will hopefully come back fairly soon. He says he's feeling fine. And then we've got a John Heasley rookie card and a Brandon Marsh rookie card. Those are not numbered, but they very colorful. And then we've got a Jake McCarthy rookie card. So not bad. We got our framed card like we were supposed to, which is good. Next we'll move to the blaster. We get more cards, more framed cards, and hopefully something nice. You can pull autos out of the retail. I haven't seen one yet, but it can happen. Got Grover Alexander. Got Josh Donaldson. Got our first red frame parallel is a rookie of Connor Wong. Got a rookie card of O'Neill Cruz, who the Pirates should call up fairly quickly. I mean, they're awful and he's pretty good. I'm sure he could help. Got an artist's palette of Boba Shett, whose bat seems to be waking up a little bit recently. Then we got a Shane Boz rookie card. Pretty happy about that. My raise. Hopefully he's healthy and ready to go soon. Next we've got Sandy Koufax, Charlie Blackman, Carl Hubble. We've got an artist proof of Connor Wong. It's a rookie card. Where did I put my artist proof? There it is. We've got a, an aficionado of Vladimir Guerrero Jr. and Tris Speaker. Got regular Beau Bichette, Satchel Page, Kirby Puckett. This is the regular Tony Santin rookie card without the frame. Got a Maestros of Shane Bieber. Who hasn't been too much of a maestro this year. He's been down a bit. And Christian Yelich. This 
This actually seems fairly... Well, it's thick, so it probably has one of the uh, frame parallels in it, since we're supposed to end up with three. But it's the only one of the three that feels like that, so I'll save it for last, just in case. We've got Eddie Stanky, Eddie Murray, Freddie Freeman, three cards in a row with their first name rhymes. Got a Hans Kraus rookie card. Got a Francisco Lindor Modern Strokes. And we've got an Aaron Ashby rookie card. Got Ed Rausch, Javier Baez, Jose Altuve. Got a Walter Alston Artist Proof. Got a Christian Yelich Gallery of Stars. And a Pee Wee Reese. And then we have our final pack. Hmm. It doesn't. I don't think it's a frame, and I think it's backwards, so we might actually have a hit. We've got Cabrian Hayes, who finally hit his first home run of the year. We've got Jazz Chisholm. We've got a Luis Heel rookie card for the Yankees, who unfortunately just had Tommy John. We've got another Jazz Chisholm. Oh, that's <laughs> that was the same one that was blocking the hit. Maybe, yeah. So we've got a Joan Adon, a double relic card, pitcher for the Nationals, he hasn't been too bad, but that's pretty neat, wasn't expecting a hit, but we got a double relic, so that's awesome. Then we've got our uh, Drew Ellis Artist Proof Rookie card, and a, the Art of Hitting Rogers Hornsby card. So we got some pretty cool inserts. We've got our uh, our double relic. Interesting that on the side of the box it says we should unwrap three retail exclusive artists. Oh, I guess those are our okay. So our artist proof blue parallels. So they just have the artist proof is surrounded by blue instead of not. So that's terribly exciting, but they're not numbered. So that was those. We didn't pull it downtown, of course. But out of our Diamond Kings, we did get our two frame cards. They are both rookies, so that's nice. Then we got our double relic for Joan Adon. And some cool cards. So I hope you enjoyed watching the video. Thank you very much.